It's 6.40 now on a Thursday morning, and we are talking with U.S. Senator and gubernatorial candidate David Vitter this morning in the Sunrise Studio. Good morning. Thanks for Good joining morning. us. Good morning. Great hey, to be with you. Brooklyn. I know it's a very busy time sure. just with sure. the news we have going on. It's hard to select the topics we want to discuss because yeah. there are so many. Let's start with uh, the highway bill. This is something Absolutely. that a lot of people are paying attention to yep, as we should. feel like every day we've got delays on the right. I-10 Calcasieu River right. Bridge. Tell us how this could affect people locally. Well, the federal highway program is expiring very soon, so we have to accept extend it and renew it. I'm working very hard. I happen to be on the relevant committee, second-ranking Republican there, to get a full six-year bill, a longer-term mm -hmm. bill, to create stability so we can really get going with these important projects, including the I-10 bridge here, including I-10 widening all through this area. With all the industrial activity coming to southwest Louisiana, that is very important. Mm -hmm. The good news is those projects are very high-ranked in terms of state priorities. And the further good news is, if we get this highway bill done, we'll get many more federal dollars here for key projects like that. We used to be a donor state. I've worked with others, and we're now getting back more than the federal gasoline tax dollars that we send to Washington. Okay, well, you mentioned a six-year plan. Let's yeah. talk timeline because, of course, we want to see this happen soon. Right, sure. um, when could we actually see something like this progress if it passes? Yeah, well, hopefully in that time frame. As you know, DOTD State Highway Department has been dragging its feet for a long time, study after study after study, and there was a chemical issue related to the bridge, and they had to look at that. We need to get beyond studying. Mm -hmm and have a plan and move forward with it. They're still studying and developing a plan, including the exact location of a new bridge. Uh, but hopefully that'll be wrapped up in a year or so and we'll move on. Okay.